Uh, Luke Riddle has uh, made some great strides in fire service. Uh, you know, they uh, started the program up in, uh, at uh, the Career Center, and he, he has been very uh, much ahead of the game as far as getting uh, young people involved in fire service, getting them trained, and then actually going on and actually uh, getting them uh, some assistance as far as getting them out on some of the full-time uh, positions throughout the different counties uh, that has full-time firemen. Uh, but he has made some great strides with this, and uh, just uh, with his recognition, just wanted to uh, recognize him on a county level for all that he has done. Uh, he just continues to really knock it out of the park when he's uh, with the uh, young folks that he works with up there, and uh, it's just really excelled in uh, that program well. Uh, my name is Luke Riddle, and I am the firefighting instructor at the Anderson District's 1 and 2 Career and Technology Center in Williamston. And I, remind people what we're here today, why you're here at the county council meeting today. So. Uh, I am here today to uh, to get honored or, um, uh, by the Anderson County Council by uh, Ray, Ray Graham, uh, Councilman Graham uh, nominated me um, for uh, being the Region 2 AC, uh, ACTE Teacher of the Year. I, I think it's an incredible opportunity for um, myself and really the school, um, the opportunity to be able to um, show what career and technology education is about to the community is so important because I feel like in past um, years uh, vocational education had a, had a very negative stigma. You know, this is a student that's not smart enough to go to college or this is just someone who's going to learn a trade. Career and technology education has evolved well beyond that. We have so many honors students and honors programs and, and now we're not only about preparing students for, um, for the careers but also for college and to prepare for careers down the road. And tell people about what you're teaching. So I'm the firefighting instructor. Um, and to, I started in 2010. Uh, the program itself at Anderson Career and Technology Center, the firefighting programs also started in 2010. And we are basically an extension of the South Carolina Fire Academy. So the students come into our program. Um, they become certified through the South Carolina Fire Academy through legislation that was passed in 2010. And on their 18th birthday, they are a certified firefighter, both um, state and nationally, as well as a nationally registered EM. So our students graduate from the program and they are ready to go to work and go into the workforce. And if somebody's watching this and they know somebody who may have a kid who's interested, where can they find out more information? So definitely our website, that would be step one. Um, we're not the only program in the state that offers this, this program, um, but it is a great program for anyone interested in serving community or just learning about the fire service in general. Because in Anderson County, there's um, almost 900 volunteer firefighters. So not only is firefighting a career, but firefighting can also be a way to serve the community through the volunteer setting.